assalamu alaikum students we learned in different reactions that effervescence take place or bubbling out of gas but how can we identify which gas it is so in today's topic we will learn how a particular gas is identified and what substances are used for gas identification their reactions and visual observation there are six gases in your syllabus out of these six gases here are the three gases these three gases are hydrogen oxygen carbon dioxide these are odorless gases means you cannot feel any smell of these gases these are also colorless they are not having any color so it is difficult to identify the presence of these three gases so we have to perform certain tests to identify their presence so the test for hydrogen is place a lighted splint at the mouth of test tube in which the gas is producing if the lighted splint extinguish with pop sound it confirms the presence of hydrogen so here is the observation you have to learn the test and their observation in case of oxygen insert a glowing splint into a test tube and if the glowing splint is rekindled means it start burning with more glow it means the gas is oxygen you have to learn this test and its observation third gas is carbon dioxide carbon dioxide gas can be tested by bubbling the gas through lime water lime water is a clear solution if it turn into milky white it means the gas is carbon dioxide you have to learn the test and its observation the other three gases are of pungent smell it means these three gases can be distinguished from the previous three gases because they are having pungent smell chlorine sulfur dioxide ammonia and among these three chlorine is having greenish yellow color whereas there is no color of sulfur dioxide and ammonia gas so how can we test the presence of these gases by performing a certain experiment by placing a piece of moist blue litmus paper at the mouth of test tube from where the gas is liberating the moist blue litmus paper if it turns red and then bleach it means the gas is chlorine bleach mean removal of color so here is the test and the observation in case of sulfur dioxide we perform the test place a piece of filter paper soaked with acidified potassium dichromate potassium dichromate is a transition metal salt obviously a colored substance and it is also an oxidizing agent what is oxidizing agent how it act we will discuss this in the topic of oxidation and reduction potassium dichromate is an orange color salt and its solution is orange solution by soaking the filter paper in acidified potassium dichromate and bring it at the mouth of test tube if it will turn green it means the gas is sulfur dioxide in case of ammonia place a piece of moist red litmus paper at the mouth of test tube and if the red litmus paper turns blue it confirms the presence of ammonia so these are the six gases that are very important because their test and their observation are asked in the exams so you have to learn the six gases are hydrogen oxygen carbon dioxide chlorine sulfur dioxide and ammonia you have to learn their color their order if there is any color and their test and its observation the homework is you have to memorize the table memorize the test of identification of gas and then you have to answer this question with justification